All right, Chadians, that is a word I haven't used in a long time, but um, welcome back to another episode, and I can't stress this enough, trying cancerous foods so you don't have to. And today is something special, actually. Um, I really don't, oh, I guess I do. I did test a drink on here today, but um, well, I did test a drink in this um, series. But today we have Pineapple Pepsi from Little Caesars. Which sounds utterly probably disgusting because I've seen they came out with the lime one. I cannot find a lime one anywhere. So if anybody knows where to find one, um, tag me down below. I probably find it at my local Myers or Walmart or something, but I don't know. And also we have this infinite swirl. Now they came out with a few. Mountain Dew came out with a few um, crazy flavors, and I like to try them all. Sort of like the. Uh, do the the what's 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 the halloween one you know what i'm talking about anyways but you know this is something really new here this one is the one i'm interested in for and if you can see on the back i don't know if i can get that clear enough let me see look at that 137 added sugars now that is ridiculous for a pop but it does say that has 69 total of grams for sugar that is uh that is ridiculous. And for the Mountain Dew, it's 76 grams with 152. I did not notice that when I was grabbing these bottles. But you know what? Hey, I'm your test dummy here. And you know me. I always got to investigate something. Now, if you were to ask me, does pineapple go with Pepsi? Um, I don't know. I don't know. Let's, um, let's try it out. All right, so everybody knows. Let's get that little crisp in there. Now, I'm not a pop drinker, so this, um, how do you say it? This uh, review could be really bad because I don't drink pop like that anymore like I used to. It's been like, what, three years since I've been drinking pop? So let's get that little crisp, that crisp snap real quick. Oh my god, that just exploded on me. What? Pause. That just exploded on me. Should I drink this? Ooh. Ooh. So the sniff test is it does smell like pineapples. I can't believe that just exploded on me. It kind of smells like a monster. Like the green monster. That's what it smells like. Yeah, that's what I'm getting from this. It smells like a... Uh, pineapple smell but the i think the pepsi and the pineapple together makes it smell like a monster like a regular green monster so um let's give it a try all right pineapple pepsi i mean i taste the pineapple it just tastes like a pepsi with pineapple and i mean that's what it's supposed to be Now, would I pick this out of anything? No. I wouldn't pick this over like a regular, like a, a root beer or something. Like, I, I would rather drink a root beer than this. But it's not, it's not bad, should I say. But it's, it, it's, like I said, it's nothing that I would pick up before any other pops. If I was still drinking pop, you know, wink, wink. No, I'm just kidding. But, um, not bad. You can only find that Little Caesars, which is pretty weird why they would only put that Little Caesars. Apparently because it's a collaboration of something of some sort. But, um, hey, man, I give it a 5 out of 10. 5 out of 10 sounds at least a little decent. No, I give it a 7. 7 out of 10. This is coming from a... Wait a minute. Uh, the aftertaste is kind of garbage. I'll keep it at 6. 6 out of 10 for the Pineapple Pepsi. All right, so next is Mountain Dew Swirl. Now, Mountain Dew is ridiculous with sugar in it. Um, I'm not here to sound like a nerd or be a, a buzzkill towards you people that drink pop. But um, with the blast of artificial pineapple berry flavor. So this is another pineapple. This is the episode of pineapples right here. And um, I have a feeling that it's, I don't know. It's just gonna taste like Mountain Dew, sort of like a Baja Blast. So um, let's get the let's get the crisp opening of this. Okay. All right. 
that one wasn't as bad as the Pepsi one, but um, yeah, let's uh, pineapple Mountain Dew. So this is the episode of pineapples, I guess. So. I don't know, dude. I don't know what to say. I mean, it, the, all, the Mountain Dews all kind of taste the same when it comes to flavor. It just has that tanginess of Mountain Dew in it. It, I don't know. I just taste Baja Blast. I mean, maybe there's a hint of pineapple in there, but dude, it just tastes like Mountain Dew. That's all it does. It tastes like a Baja Blast, basically. Um, what do I rate it? Um, let's give it a, let's give it a, a Mountain Dew out of 10. I don't know. Five out of 10. How does that sound? And this is coming from a non-pop drinker. So, uh, if there's anybody out there in the comments that want to like, you know, hang me for this review, I really don't care. This is, um, these pops are garbage. I wouldn't drink them. Um, I kind of wasted my money on this for review. The episode of pineapples is what this is going to be called. So, um, yeah, yeah, not, not bad. Not bad. I still don't taste it. I maybe, maybe I'm just, you know, I just can't taste flavors. You know, maybe that's what's going on. I don't know. Definitely. I can taste it in this one. The pineapple for sure. You can taste it in this one. This one just tastes like a Baja blast, probably like a hint of pineapple. But then, again, but then again, Baja Blast is supposed to be tropical. So, um, yeah. And that, ladies and gentlemen, has been the episode of Pineapples in Pop.